Hey all, and what I'm going to do during this video is talk a bit about the cross-server events. Currently there's an event for consumption up, there's also an event for obtaining items. So what the consumption event basically means is use any of the items you can see here and you will gain points. Then if you go over to here, you can claim rewards based on how many points you have obtained. So what you want to do for this version of the event is try and save up as many items as possible. Don't use them before the event is up. Then when it's up, go ahead and use them all. Gain as many points as possible. For both events though, saving a few diamonds might be useful. You can obtain extra items from the shop, gain a few extra points. The event for obtaining items though, is probably a good time to go ahead and use all of your items here, the lost maps, you can gain quite a few items for this event from the multiplayer dungeons. So what I'm going to do here now is use all my items I have been saving up. There's quite a few items actually that I have been saving. If we go down to here you can see 553 holy feathers for a start. 763 beast spirit stone, I'm not sure if that was an item in the event. I know for a fact that the empowered sapphires were, even though I'm going to need a lot of gold to use all of those. So let's go ahead and use the holy feathers you can see here, I'll just click quick upgrade, then show you what that has done. I can already claim the first four rewards from this event just by using the holy feathers. And these crystals you get are very useful actually. These are the mount crystals. Very useful for upgrading your mount. Right, I've just boosted up my gold a little bit for this event. So I can go ahead and use my empowered sapphires. Let's build up some of these. There you go, I'll probably use up most of this gold. I've been saving gold bags in my backpack for this event. I do that so I don't lose any gold just in case someone does decide to attack me. I don't like storing up huge amounts of gold. I know you only lose a maximum of 1 million gold if you do get attacked but it's still 1 million gold you could avoid losing by playing a little bit differently. Anyway I'm out of empowered sapphires so let's go ahead and claim the next reward. Nice, and I will go ahead and go over to the mounts as well. I think just increase defense here. There we go, nice. That's the maximum amount of items that I had for there. Oh, I can cheer the daily ranking as well, and now I can claim the 20,000 point reward as well. So you get the idea for this event. Basically what you want to do is just save up as many items as possible, then use them when the correct event is up. Just be careful though, check the event carefully in case it's not consumption. If it's the event for obtaining items, you don't want to go ahead and use all your items during that event as they will be wasted. Anyway, I hope that helps a little bit with this event. One of the highest scoring items is those promotion sapphires you can see here. I just need a few more and I will be able to promote Siegfried you can see here. I just need four more. I'm going to see if I can do that during the event. That will give a huge chunk of points if I can manage that. Anyway I'm going to end the video at this point. I wanted to keep it short and sweet. Hopefully that was helpful. If you do have any questions or suggestions regarding this, please let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to help. If you did enjoy this video or if you did find it helpful, please do give it a like and subscribe to the channel. Subscribing is always very much appreciated. I've included a previous video on the screen, plus a playlist, plus you can also subscribe from here if you want to do so. And thanks for watching.